Today, we have some interesting news about Jeezy and Jeannie Mai. Amidst their contentious divorce battle, Jeezy has some new demands, and we've got all the details. Let's get into the specifics. Rapper Jeezy is making an effort to keep the details of his contentious divorce with Jeannie Mai hidden from the public. As the divorce proceedings intensify, the rapper and businessman has filed a motion requesting that the judge seal sensitive personal and financial information, as well as any material pertaining to their daughter Monaco. Jeezy, whose real name is J. Wayne Jenkins, alleges that since filing for divorce in September of last year, the press has been harassing him and Mai because of their celebrity status as public figures. Jeezy filed on the 21st of February in Georgia's Fulton County Court before his scheduled court appearance with Mai in March. According to Jeezy's filing, since the filing of this action, they and, most importantly, their child, have become the subject of intense media scrutiny and publications in connection with their divorce action that are directly contrary to the best interests of the child. The Seen It All rapper claimed that his two-year marriage was irretrievably broken when he filed for divorce from my last year. According to Jeezy, things have only gotten worse between him and the former talk show host since that time. As the parties work through the issues surrounding their divorce, sensitive personal and financial information, as well as information related to the child, will necessarily be discussed and disclosed, the filing adds. This litigation, tragically, is becoming more contentious as a result. On March 1st, Jeezy and Mai were supposed to appear in court in Fulton County Superior Court with their attorneys present to discuss matters such as custody and their prenuptial agreement. Because of her legitimate concerns about the integrity of Jeezy's financial disclosure and the quick nature of the forceful pressure to sign the agreement, Mai has requested a judge to refuse Jeezy's plea to enforce the prenup. Since the end of their relationship, Jeezy has accused Mai of gatekeeping their daughter. Mai disputes this accusation and says she is worried about Monaco's safety while in Jeezy's custody because of his weapons. Mai submitted a document in December that states, it is essential to clarify that Miss Jenkins' insistence on reasonable safety measures being put in place, such as safely securing and locking away all firearms that have been unsecure in the past, as well as having familiarity and properly trained caregivers is absolutely not gatekeeping, but rather a responsible effort to prioritize their daughter's well-being. As much as Jeezy and Jeannie Mai might look like water and oil right now, they were not always like this. The put-on rapper, whose real name is J. Wayne Jenkins, and the former co-host of The Real First connected on her daytime talk show in November 2018 and started dating in private. That August, they attended a fundraiser for his nonprofit Street Dreams, and made their official couple debut. My Jenkins was a co-host on The Real, and she was never afraid to share personal details about herself. She answered the question straight when the rumors about her and the rapper began to circulate. You guys know that I'm multi-dating, right? Jeezy and I hang out, she continued. He's very special to me, so we don't really have a label to define what it is we're doing. We're just having a good time together. She continued saying, real fam, you know, I always keep it a little too real at this table. I promise you that when there is that one special boo, you will be the first to know from me. My Jenkins talked extensively on the differences between her romance with Jeezy and her former marriage to Freddie Hardays, whom she divorced in 2017 after 10 years of marriage. She was talking to her co-host saying, I didn't even know until my new relationship that something as basic, even something as basic as like at his birthday party, he left his birthday to drive me to the airport. He was looking at me like, are you crazy? I need to see you off. I'm going to drive you to the airport. So I'm just saying just be mindful of your standards. The couple posted their first Instagram pictures together less than a week after it was revealed that Jeezy and Mai Jenkins were dating. The host Jeannie Mai captioned alongside a picture at the beach, securely encircled in Jeezy's arms. SHT, hello honey, took on a whole new meaning. She then added emojis. Jeezy captioned a picture he took of the two of them on Instagram saying, she love when I talk dat fly SHT. He then added a kiss emoji and hashtag WCW. As a couple, Jeezy and Mai Jenkins celebrated Thanksgiving with enough to be grateful for. Jeannie talked about it and said, it was an unforgettable, surreal moment. It was the first time that we obviously spent Thanksgiving together and to be able to have an intimate dinner with his family. They're all such lovely people and they're fun. 
She had never met some of Jeezy's family members before. They got mad cousins. And if you saw Jeezy's Instagram story, we turned it into a lit, lit party afterwards, she said. There was a DJ, and there was electric sliding. There was a lot of things going on. Even Jeezy's aunt gave Maya a special treat. She came with Tupperware, Chitlins and Oxtail, and they were just for me, she said. They weren't for everyone and she was like, these are just for you, don't let anyone else have them. It was so wonderful to meet his family and be able to spend time together. It was special. On Valentine's Day, my Jenkins and her boyfriend took a ride. Jenkins was shown being tightly held by the television personality in a video that was uploaded to her Instagram account while he was riding a bicycle down the street. My Jenkins then lets go and begins to dance and sing along to hip hop at one point. With the hashtag VDay vibes, my captioned the photo writing, sexiest Uber driver ever. When the epidemic broke out and the entire world went into lockdown, Jeezy's proposal plans went wrong. Nevertheless, the rapper refused to back down and instead proposed on a memorable date night at his Los Angeles home. An insider was the one who revealed the information. Jeannie and Jay were set for a trip to Vietnam this April. What Jeannie didn't know is that Jay was planning to propose. Instead, Jay decided to bring Vietnam to Jeannie with a surprise quarantine date night in his home filled with Vietnamese food and decor. Jeezy posted a picture of himself and Mai Jenkins on Instagram to commemorate their engagement, along with the message, would say for life, but that's not long enough. Infinity, he added a black heart emoji. Despite the fact that it was his birthday on September 28, 2020, Jeezy chose to focus on his fiance, who became a member of the Dancing with the Stars roster for season 29. In order to support Mai Jenkins in her quest to advance in the reality dance competition, the rapper bought a billboard. Jeezy shared a video of the Los Angeles billboard on Instagram. I know it's my G-Day, but that ain't gone stop me from showing love on your big day. Kill it tonight. As part of the Disney night theme of the performance, Mai Jenkins also paid tribute to her lover. She chose the song Married Life from the movie Up to Jeezy as the theme for her Viennese waltz. She revealed how the song made her think of their romance after scoring 22 out of 30. She said, I specifically chose this dance because Jay is the love of my life and honestly when we met, I pictured the beginning of this. Because when you watch it, if you don't have somebody, you think about that somebody. And the minute I met Jay, I couldn't wait to grow old with him, happily ever after. So this is for you baby. Their courtship caused a stir later that year when Mai confessed she was eager to submit to her new husband. Jeannie said, in order for us to make the music we can together, in order for us to do our dance in life, I have to allow him to be the framework for our marriage and our life. She continued, he knows enough to ask me the questions to incorporate what I want to build into the vision for us together. I am so excited to submit because in my life, I am such a boss. I'm a boss in the way I wake up, the jobs that I choose, my career path, the people I hang out with, even where to eat and what to do in one 24-hour day is all my decision. I'm a very dominant woman. I own my business, I lead my teams, I played my own manager, my own publicist, my own lawyer when I didn't have money to have those people. She finished saying, so, I make the decisions in my life. When I come home, I like the idea that my man leads us. Through progression, Mai Jenkins and Jeezy tied the knot in a modest ceremony at their Atlanta home in March 2021. Following Jeezy's mother's untimely death two months earlier, the ex-couple accelerated their wedding plans. We quickly learned that life is too short. And at the end of the day, Jeezy and I really just wanted to become husband and wife. So, we decided to turn our original wedding into a mini-money, where we exchanged our vows in front of our immediate family and a few close friends. Jeannie disclosed that she had miscarried one month before to their wedding, she went on to state that she was expecting her first child with Jeezy. And even though the former cast member of Dancing with the Stars formerly had a hard stop never rule on having kids, the couple welcomed Monaco into the world in January 2022. At that time, Mai Jenkins stated, Falling in love with Jeezy made me see life differently for myself. Our love is honest, pure and safe, something I hadn't felt as a child. After two years of marriage, Jeezy filed for divorce from Jeannie in September 2023. The Seen It All rapper declared that there was no hope for reconciliation and that their marriage was irretrievably broken. Tell us in the comments what you think about how their marriage ended. 
do you think it ended too fast? Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel for more updates on what's happening with your favorite stars.